Hello everyone and welcome. I am Empress Queen Tay from Empress Queen Tay Tarot and Oracle. And Miss Nicole from Spiritual Guidance Academy has given me a wonderful opportunity to give you guys 12 tarot and oracle readings. Yes, boo. Thank you so much to Miss Nicole and Spiritual Guidance Academy for this very blessed, wonderful opportunity, okay? So you guys, please subscribe to Spiritual Guidance Academy channel. Leave us a comment, okay? Hit the thumbs up. Let us know how the video resonated with you, okay? Before I get into the spread, I do want to make some things clear. Tarot is an energy. I read energy. So if it resonates with you, but part of it didn't, that's fine. Take what is for you, leave what is not, okay? Also, these messages are timeless, you guys. So these messages are meant to find you whenever they're meant to find you, okay? And with that being said, boo, we are going to get into this reading, okay? Thank you again to Miss Nicole and Spiritual Guides Academy for this wonderful opportunity, okay? So we're going to get into this reading, honey, with... The Keepers of the Light Oracle deck, okay? I'm going to see what energy is coming out for the collective that I may be resonating with either now or at a later date. Archangels, Ancestors, Father God, Divine Holy Spirit. What is coming through for the collective that I may be resonating with either now or at a later date? Archangels, Ancestors, Father God, Divine Holy Spirit. What energy is coming through for the collective that I may be resonating with either now? I had a little bit. Divine Holy Spirit. What is the energy surrounding? Thank you. And we have focused intention. Think about what you desire. Set your sights high. Expect the best possible outcome. Okay. So you're needing to stay focused. Okay, stay determined, stay focused, constantly feel, well, not constantly, but, you know, always think about what it is you desire and, and set your sights high. Okay, and don't expect nothing but the best possible outcome and spirit is giving me it's going to be even better than that. Okay, spirit wants me to also pull a devotion. Okay, trust your spiritual guidance. Your commitment has been recognized. You are loved and you are loved unconditionally okay so not only are you you know very devoted to what it is that you're doing what it is that you're putting out there okay very devoted to your spiritual guidance your spiritual team they're recognizing that they're saying you know we're going to bless you for this Okay, expect the best possible outcome stay focused on what it is that you desire okay so we're going to go in with the soul's journey deck. Okay, no. Okay, spirit wants me to go in with the mystical wisdom deck. Okay, archangels, ancestors, father, God, divine, Holy spirit. Okay, spirit wants me to pull the back of the deck energy here. Okay, originality, blaze your own trail. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit is directing me to get the book. So I'm going to get the book. And I just feel like, you know, whatever it is that you're desiring right now, whatever it is that you're focusing on, it is totally original to you. Okay, whatever this is that you're setting out to do, you're blazing your own trail. Boo, and you are so happy about it. Okay, a lot of yellow coming off, a lot of creative energy here. Solar plexus chakra energy popping off on this card here. Okay. Just stay focused on what it is that you're desiring. Spirit is giving me. Okay. So I'm going to go in. And this says, you are a go-getter and a free spirit by nature. You exhibit originality, courage, and defiance. You were born to succeed and breathe excitement, love, and life into lives of others. Despite your chaotic ways and your nature, you are loving and generous. Mantra, love me without fear. Trust me without wondering. Love me without restriction. Love me without demands. I am worth it. 
Okay. Oh, that's some beautiful energy here. <clears throat> okay. I feel like the collective that I am reading for is just very unique. Okay. Very eccentric. Dance to the beat of your own drum. Okay. Very tapped in. Very intuitive. I'm getting as well. Okay, just very unique individuals. Okay, you do things out of the ordinary all the time is what I'm getting. Okay, but you're focused on something big here. You're trying to burst something big. Okay, and whatever this is that you're doing, this originality, this thing that you're doing, for those of you who are trying to put something out there for the world to use or be a part of. Okay, this is something big that is coming true. You need it to stay focused. Trust the guidance that's coming through to you. Okay, and so now Spirit wants me to go in with the Soul's Truth deck, okay? Archangels, Ancestors, Father God, Divine, Holy Spirit. What is coming through for the collective that I may be resonating with either now or at a later date? Archangels, Ancestors, Father God, Divine, Holy Spirit. What is coming through? Okay, we got courage and acceptance. Okay, coming through change. Coming through, okay? change at the bottom of the deck divine holy spirit what is coming through for the collective that i may be resonating with either now or at a later date what is coming through for the collective archangels ancestors father god divine holy spirit what is coming through for the collective that i may be resonating with archangels ancestors father god okay and we have abundance I am a limitless being and I can manifest whatever I desire in this physical reality. Okay. Boo. I love that energy. Okay. Your devotion is coming out and equal into abundance. Just for you being you, blazing your own trail. Even though you I get hot tempered off of this card as well. But you, you just mean all well. Okay, something I feel like you're working on with that. You've come from a long way, okay? And you're just needing to stay focused. Trust your guidance, okay? Trust what it is that you're doing, okay? Just being original, okay? I get fool energy. I get magician energy off of this. So you're trusting in something. You're creating something here, okay? So I'm going to go in with the Work Your Life Oracle Day. And I'm going to see what is coming through. What message is coming through from the higher self. Okay, no spirit just wants me to use this deck. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit, what is coming through for the collective that I may be reading for either now or at a later date? Archangels, ancestors, Father God, Divine Holy Spirit. Allow me to tap into the energies of the collective. What is coming through? Divine Holy Spirit is coming through for the collective. What do they need to know? Thank you. And we have the crumbling. What are you clinging on to? Okay. So I feel like there is something here, okay, that you're needing to let go of. Definitely, you're seeing, you're seeing the other side of something. You're recognizing something. You've been devoted for to something, but it's this, this last little bit that you're receiving clarity on that you're just needing to move past. And I have Anna, grandmother of Jesus, seeding the light, laying foundations, divine plan. Okay, and this is laying the groundwork. Okay, I feel Ten of Pentacles energy off of this card right here. This is laying the groundwork for abundance for, you know, generations to come. This is also laying the groundwork. Some of you guys may be studying something. You may be researching something, developing something that is laying a groundwork. Okay, for even more to come, for people to follow. Okay. I also do feel like, you know, a, a very heavy reincarnation spirit here, okay? I really feel like a lot of you guys are very creative, okay? Some of you guys know, you know, 
all how you're interconnected. For some of you guys, you've lived lifetimes over. Okay. And some of you guys know that. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit wants me to get another one. Divine Holy Spirit, what else is coming out for the collective that I'm reading for? What is the energy? Thank you. We have Akashic. Akasha. Your guidance is divinely guided. Okay. You have trust your spiritual guidance. Okay. And you have your guidance is divinely guided. Okay. To this abundance. To whatever this is connecting to. That is this all you I'm feeling. It's all originally you. It's just that you're needing to move past something. You're needing to stay focused on something here. Okay. You might be thinking the worst of a situation. You see the other side. But is this something about this situation that might be blocking you? Spirit is giving me. But you're just needing to, you know, set your sights high and expect the best. Don't dwell in anything less than expecting the best. Okay, because abundance is here. Okay, you've come from a long way. Okay, to laying foundations. For some of you, a lot, a lot of hardships. Okay, so we're going to go in. Spirit is wanting me to get an affirmation. Okay. Archangels, ancestors, Father God, divine, Holy Spirit. What's the affirmation for the collective that I'm reading for either now or at a later date? Archangels, ancestors, Father God, divine, Holy Spirit. And I feel like this is why that laying the groundwork came out. Okay. Because I feel like there's something that you're doing that is original. Okay. For some of you, you know, the prototype or whatever this is that you're doing, it's going to bring this abundance in. It hasn't even been, you know, the groundwork for it hasn't even been like really laid yet. Like, laid yet. I can't even talk. Like, I feel like this is something, you know, some of you are doing that others have never even done before. Okay. Something new, something very creative, innovative here. I'm feeling okay, strongly. Something that is going to touch a lot of people. For some of you all over the world, you're, you're some type of developer, some type of creator for some of you. Okay? Divine Holy Spirit, what is the affirmation for the collective? What is the affirmation? Thank you. And we have, I am safe in the universe and all life loves and supports me. I breathe in the fullness and richness of life. I observe with joy as life abundantly supports me and supplies me with more good than I can imagine. Okay, and that's that abundance that's coming in again. Okay, look, it's right here. Abundantly. Abundance. Okay, it is definitely here for you. It's definitely here for the collective that I'm reading for. Whatever this is, this trail that you're blazing, this is the abundant trail. Even if it doesn't have with you being a developer or developing something, it is something that you're doing that's unique to you. Okay, that is allowing you to have this richness in life, to feel this richness in life. And observe how, you know, the world... You know, the universe, God, the Holy Spirit source, okay? However you resonate, it's supporting you at this time. So we're going to go in with an angel oracle message. Archangels, ancestors, Father God. A guardian angel oracle message. Archangels, ancestors, Father God, divine, Holy Spirit. What is coming through for the collective that I may be resonating with either now or at a later date? Archangels, ancestors, Father God, divine, Holy Spirit. And we have encouragement. Your love is invaluable to the earth and to those around you. Even though you may not always see the positive effects your love has on others trust for it does each time you offer love through a loving gesture thought or word you plant a seed of love and love always generates more love trust and continue your loving work okay 
And I'm also getting like spiritual healers, spiritual teachers off of this card as well, okay? And this is this is just encouragement. Your guardian angels are here to encourage you, okay? That what you're doing, it does make a difference. What you're developing, what you're coming up with, what you're trying to create, it does make a difference. You are laying the foundation <clears throat> towards something, okay? You're just needing to move away from something that you're holding on to maybe it's a way of thinking maybe it's a way of being maybe it's a way of acting okay but yeah i really feel that this is yeah this is something positive okay something positive that's coming in okay for the very uniquely original people that you know maybe don't really, you know, tune in, but with a certain group, like you resonate with a certain group of people. Like, you know, you may not be everybody's person is what I'm getting off of that energy. <clears throat> okay. So you want to go in with a six card spread and I'm using the angels and ancestors oracle deck. Okay. And this is going to be a message. Six cards. First card is your energy. Second card is what's grounding you. Third card is what's your goals and desires, energy around that. Fourth card is going to be energy around what you need to let go of. Fifth card is going to be read, direct your intentions and your energy towards. Sixth card is going to be advice and outcome. And then we're going to go over that with tarot, okay? Archangels, ancestors, Father God, allow me to tap into the collective's energy. Give me clear, precise messages that resonate with the collective that are involved here in this message. Archangels, ancestors, Father God, divine, and spirit. Divine Holy Spirit, where is the energy of the collective that I'm reading for either now or at a later date? Divine Holy Spirit, where is the energy around the collective that I'm reading for? Thank you. <clears throat> and we have high priest intend and create. Okay. <clears throat> so like I said, I feel a lot of that, you know, originality coming off of here. Okay. Setting your intentions on something, thriving towards something. Okay, being devoted towards something as well. High priest, and I, I, I'm, I'm getting devotion. I'm, I'm attaching these two cards. Spirits is attaching these two cards for me. Trust your spiritual guidance. Okay, here. Staying in this energy right here. Divine Holy Spirit. What else is coming through for the collective? Where's the energy around the collective? Love and let yourself be loved. Heart guardian. I feel like this is, yeah, this is your spiritual team coming in with more encouragement. Okay. Stay in this loving energy. Okay. Whatever your intentions are, I feel like they're very pure intentions at this time. Okay. Stay on this path. This is what spirit is giving me. Back of the deck energy shed old skin. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit is grounding this collective. Thank you. We have animal guardian. Trust your instincts. Okay. Following your inner calling. Okay. Trust your spiritual guidance coming out again. Okay. Those king instincts. Okay. Those divine spiritual animals. They have very precise instincts on different things that allow them to survive. Okay. And I feel like this is what's grounding your instincts, how you're moving, okay? And I definitely feel like you're moving from a loving space, a heartfelt space, okay? Whether if that's received by everyone or not, okay? Divine Holy Spirit, what's the energy around the desires for the collective that I'm reading for? What is the energy around the desires? Thank you. And we have Shaolin Master Move. Be graceful in movement and action. And we have High Priestess Harness Mystic Power. Okay, so we have a beautiful balance of divine masculine and divine feminine energy here. For others of you, I'm getting a sense of, okay, this is going to be a new um, a new relationship that's coming in. Or for some of you, you already connected to your soulmate for some of you. Okay, for others of you, I feel a divine, a divine connection. 
coming in. Okay, you have the high priestess and the high priest, both divine feminine and masculine energy. And I feel like overall for the collective, this is a beautiful balance because you're moving from a loving space and you're trusting your spiritual guidance here. Okay, and how you're moving, you're not trying to sabotage anything. Okay, or you don't want to sabotage anything. Okay. You're utilizing, I feel like you're you're utilizing or you're going to start utilizing all the energies of abundance that's around you just by being yourself. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit, what's the energy around what the collective needs to let go of? Divine Holy Spirit, what is the energy around what the collective? Thank you. And we have wise one grow within your current situation. Okay. So don't think something is too hard. You're very wise. You're very spiritually guided, I feel. Okay? You have went through a lot. Okay? You've overcome a lot. This person has crossed over. Okay? This person is going on to their abundance. Okay? They're steady being devoted. Okay? And I feel like this is what, you know, that energy of what you need to let go of. Whatever the situation is around what it is that you're trying to do, you're needing to stay focused with that. Okay, you do have the tower here. Okay, don't allow anything to stop you from growing and reaching another level, no matter what's going on around you. Okay, keep creating this abundance for yourself and following what you know, moving gracefully. Okay, with your actions. Okay, Divine Holy Spirit, what is the energy around the intentions? Where does the collective need to direct their energy towards their intentions? And we have Shield Maiden. Make plans and focus. Okay. And this is what you're trying to accomplish. What you're trying to move into. Just keep making plans and focus. Direct your energy on making the steps necessary. And the plans necessary to achieve and accomplish whatever this is you're trying to set out for. Divine Holy Spirit, what's the advice? What's the advice? Thank you. Shed old skin. Oh, we have two. Shed old skin wanted to come out as well. And then we have great teacher. Learn from spiritual experience. Okay. And you have the devotion here. Trust your spiritual guidance. Your commitment has been recognized. You are loved unconditionally. Okay. And I feel like this is just a confirmation. Affirmation. Okay. Coming in for the collective that's resonating with this message. Okay. Keep trusting in what it is that you've been guided to do. You have a wise one, great teacher out here. High priestess, high priest energy. You are vibrating high. You're vibrating very high here. Okay. For the collective. Okay. This is high vibrating energy right here. So we're going to go in. And we're going to do a three-card spread, past, present, future energy. And then we may get into uh, some advice, okay, archangels. And I have, you know, the chariot and the three of swords on the cut here, okay. And I feel like, you know, you guys are pulling forward from something, okay, that was heartbreaking. A time in your life that was hurting for some of you guys. You're over it, you know, it might sting a little bit here and there, okay. But you're definitely moving forward, okay. Chariot energy still on the cut, still at the back of the deck, okay, along with temperance, okay, having patience with yourself, okay, on this path that you're on to your happiness, okay, keeping this beautiful balance here, being open and receptive as you move on, okay, chariot still at the back of the deck, I'm going to cut on that. Okay, King of, King of Swords energy. And I feel like this is the collective's energy of being very clear on what it is that they want. Okay. Focused intentions. The King of Swords is very focused. Okay. And making plans. And 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 um standing by what they say. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit, what is coming out in the past energy for the collective? What is the past energy coming out for the collective? Archangels, ancestors. 
What's the past energy coming out? Thank you. An ending of a cycle, an ending of an era, an ending of a relationship. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit, what is the energy around the present? What's the present energy around the collective that I'm reading for? Okay, for some of you guys, you're going through a tough time right now. You're going through a dramatic change, a dramatic shift. Okay, you're starting something over. That's the tower coming out twice. This was a very rough ending, but this puts you on your path. Okay. This is putting you on your path to abundance. You're moving out from the old. Your advice is to shed this old skin. You have death and you have the tower card coming out twice. Divine Holy Spirit, what is the energy around the future for the collective that I'm reading for? What is the energy around the future for the collective? Thank you. Justice. Okay. You have all major arcanas coming out here. Okay. Divine Holy Spirit, what is the advice? What's the advice for the collective that I'm reading for? Be in your loving, beautiful, original, trailblazing, protected self. Okay. Keep moving forward. Divine Holy Spirit, give me some more energy around the advice. Give me some more energy around the advice, Divine Holy Spirit. The sun. <clears throat> And Spirit wants me to leave it at that. Okay. So for those of you who are resonating with this message. Okay. Being you. Being original. Blazing your own trail. Is where your happiness is at. And you can be a male. In this energy right here. This is just knowing your words. Knowing who you are. Okay. Being you. Setting your own trail. Doing what it is that make you feel good. Okay. What is it that make you truly feel happy? Trusting and leaning on what it is that you've been through, okay? Because something balanced is coming in, okay? Something very balanced is coming in. Something is shaking things up right now for you, for some of you guys. You may be going through a lot, actually, with this tower card coming out twice. And Spirit is not giving me to go ahead and clarify anything. Spirit wants me to leave it at that, and I will. But this is all major arcanas, Okay? The only card that you have, you know, and this is major as well, okay? You could be a Sagittarius. You could be a fire sign, okay? You could be dealing with a fire sign, okay? Or you could just have, you know, fire energy in your chart, okay? But this is a lot of energy coming out here, okay? For all, for it to be all major arcana, okay? And I feel like, that's speaking a lot. That's saying a lot. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. Or you could be a Scorpio. Okay. A Libra. Libra is here as well. Okay. I feel Leo energy. Okay. You could be dealing with any air sign. Okay. I also see that here. So yeah. I'm going to leave it at that you guys. I'm sending you guys nothing but love. Pure divine healing light. Okay, make sure you hit the like button. Leave us a comment. Subscribe to Spiritual Guidance Academy channel. Okay, then come check me out over at Empress Queen Tay Tarot and Oracle. Okay, so I love you guys. Okay, y'all be blessed and keep manifesting what it is that you truly want. Keep giving yourself that love. Okay, I also feel like a divine counterpart is coming in for you. You just, the sun is everything. You are just going to be so happy blazing your own trail, going after what it is that you want. Okay, laying this groundwork amongst whatever may be going on because you know towers come in not only to, you know, destroy, but to rebuild better than ever. Towers come in to help us. Okay, and that tower is definitely going to be just. Okay, it's going to lead you right to your happiness. Okay, a new you, shedding the old, shed old skin, the advice. Learn from spiritual experiences, being happy, divinely led, freeing, and letting go of old cycles. Okay, so yet again, I love you guys. Okay, bye. Until next time, y'all.